we carry on with uh, this cake study which will be presented by a lovely gentleman who has his name and surname very well prepared because he's a managing director, dear Martina, of GM Project. It is ID Mr. Goraz Mandey. And the doce. subject is integration of Iris reader, reader, access controller and interlocking door for highest grade for security level. Goraz, the floor is yours. Thank you. Enjoy. Hello and welcome on Adria Summit on behalf of my name and Mr. Said Ali who gave me great honor to be here with me. He is also regional sales manager of our vendor Iris ID from United States. So today I will present you very interesting integration of Iris Reader, Access Controller and Interlocking Door for actually best and highest possible solution for banking, safe deposits, and all different other car, um, all different other aspects for highest security for high secure uh, premises. So uh, let me enter presentation. Uh, actually, first brief scope. We actually got a task to realize such an access, uh, personal one by one uh, door access. And of course, we need many different components here. At the end, our solution was also a great for solution. I don't know whether you know in Slovenia now the international European standards are obligatory for uh, making technical security. So we needed also to obey request of the customer to give great for access control uh, solution. And what we did, of course, we have chosen the most accurate and best existing solution in terms of biometrics which is used for identification of people. Uh, more I will tell you now in advance. So, uh, first question for us was we, what and which technologies actually to be used for such a complex uh, problem. And actually our basics was that we were oriented to higher security level software and hardware scalability and of course nevertheless also the user experience is very important so user needs to feel friendly when using such a system although some minimal cooperation is also needed from the side of the user. Uh, first we used biometric property which has the highest possible safety level and of course this, this was uh, our or people's iris as mathematical method. <laughs> then we, we took iris reader and access control a system controller both we have chosen with grade 4 functionality and at the end also mechanical part was very important to use proper door entrance equipment to realize one by one uh, entry gate. Let's say for instance uh, how people get recognized you may have audio and visual. Thank you. You have been identified. Sorry, we cannot confirm system. your identity. And of course, for Adriatic region, Hvala, we can also translate these language instructions. Ne vaše so believe me, it's really, use, it's really easy to use such a system also from experience of the people of National Bank of Slovenia and New Bank of Ljubljana. Okay, maybe just very brief uh, explanation why we uh, have chosen uh, iris uh, recognition you might know uh, that level one is something that 
we possess. So these are our RF cards, our tokens, our mechanical keys. Nowadays even our mobile phones has become a part of our identification. We have here very strong advantage. It's of course very easy to use, but in the opposite way, it's easy to fraud, it's easy to fraud being stolen. You may lose it, you may somehow duplicate it, let's say 125 kilohertz cards. And of course, for body punching, so-called, uh, people can also borrow the cards to each other. It's extremely important also in terms of time and attendance. Uh, level two is something that we remember. Of course, most common is PIN. We use two-factor authorization made both of these two, let's say, for the withdrawal at the ATM cash machine. Again, it's quite easy to use, and it's, again, easy to borrow. <laughs> I always remember my grandmother. She was always wearing the RF card of the bank and, of course, small leaflet with her um, code, uh, pin code written, because she always forgot that code. And the level three, most important and the highest level, it's part of us. So, can be our behavioral, my speech now. You may know some, I don't know, airport operators use this uh, voice recognition for ordering the ticket, playing cards, or can be something which is part of me, my fingerprint, my, my hand geometric, my face geometric, and of course my iris, which has the highest uh, data uh, density. <clears throat> Again, the most important aspect is it's unique for each person. It's really unique identificator. <clears throat> and like I mentioned before, maybe a slight uh, disadvantage would be that the user still has to cooperate and of course, in Slovenia, we have very strong data protection legislative, so we also prepare uh, all the necessary um, templates and we help to our customer from the beginning to the end of this uh, process also. <coughs> Actually, why to choose iris recognition? Because it has highest information density, I mentioned it, it's most accurate among other biometric methods. It's unique and very good aspect. Your iris, is, iris pattern is constant throughout your life, which means once you are enrolled in database, you will be always recognized successfully, of course, till or when you are deleted again from such database. And mathematical algorithm, I will not be now entering the details, but it's a fact that it's irreversible, which means if I give to you my hash, you will not be able to go in reverse way and to print out my uh, picture in high resolution of my eye, like that picture one that is. Even if you were able to do it, but mathematically it's one, towards 10 upon 78, which is almost equal to zero, uh, the uh, reader will know that there is a picture because it makes autocorrelation of three pictures when, the, uh, when your iris is scanned. So it's another uh, highest possible level of uh, security and accuracy. <clears throat> a great functionality it's really important because you, with such a certificate, with such equipment, you grant it to all uh, customers that they know in advance what kind of equipment they will get. So it's also important uh, to be put in public tenders or whenever the customers actually uh, knows in advance what they really need for such a system. You see, we made our certification successfully last year, and I'm very proud 
with such certificate, our solutions are now uh, actually granted or are approved for all European unit, Union. Uh, so, uh, another thing, we used IRIS controller with encrypted and duplex communication in between controller that we put on safe site and the reader which was put on outside or a public uh, a place. <coughs> so above there, there is uh, iris controller and iris readers. Then we used great four functionality with access controller. We've chosen controller from our partner uh, Prima. You might remember Mr. Micha Ung gave presentation last year. And what we did at the end, of course, safety, entrance, we took a product from our partner Nolimal and actually to obtain automatic flow control one by one user with such a door. This is an example. You might see we put one reader at entry site, second for the opposite way uh, when exiting, and we even do put, did put additional evacuation uh, button and uh, module, and in the middle, of course, we put our iris reader for identification and for approving, for opening the second door, or first door in the opposite way while exiting. Uh, believe me, there were many different situations. We included also uh, physical security guys from our customer. We were asking them, we discussed all possible um, possibilities, uh, especially their good uh, experiences from past times, how to smuggle such a system, how to overcome it, and we made a kind of 18 different possible situations, so everything was very pre precisely checked in advanced. This was factory acceptance, where we assembled all the equipment, and it is how testing phase was looking like. So you see I'm opening the door, I'm entering the door, I need to step down on special place dedicated. I show my eyes to the system and all is completed and the second door is open. This is just normal way if everything goes okay. Yeah. So, few words, what actually the Bank of Slovenia and uh, new bank gets out of such a system. Uh, they also have also uh, these COVID restrictions obeyed with such a system because it's contactless, so no more touching. Uh, automatic capture of both irises with two adjustable cameras. The system founds your height, so you don't need any more to look for proper sizing. Harmless, it's completely, that's another certificate that it will make or it makes no harms to your eyes. And of course, high speed recognition in less than 0 0.5 seconds, you are successfully verified, so you may enter the premises. And if we count all of this, we got maximum possible level of security possible at the moment. And also another thing for integration, Interoperability is very important, which means this is the third standard we obeyed, so we can cooperate with different manufacturers. Exceptional flexibility is also at the end important. This is more or less user experience. Uh, it's standalone application also. If it gets broken uh, communication by the server, it will work standalone no matter how long time, then it will synchronize the data with the server. Mobile applications are possible. They have such one application for all other branches all over uh, Slovenia for enrollment. And nevertheless, but at the end, it's 
one of most important reasons for uh, for the uh, for our customers it's very low costs or uh, low cost maintenance after the system uh, has been implemented in the end and of course it's long term solution we just upgrade system let's say every two or three years in terms of software so few general application examples at the end i mentioned before for some special protected areas also it is very suitable let's say for it rooms some archives laboratories intellectual properties rooms we we have performed let's say interesting uh, which is globally present now uh, logging on to atm cash machines for withdrawal many such solutions we may have uh, and yes at the end maybe one sample from uh, netherlands schiphol airport and these are our global references just to give you an impression what was done up so far on the globe on different of course uh, areas and of course we can we can proudly add here bank of slovenia and a new bank of ljubljana so we are also present let's say for uh, civil identity issues let's say could be of interest for southern schengen border which is now moving from slovenia in between croatia and bosnia and to be summarized iris recognition will always give you as most secure biometric method the easiest way actually for personal identification and any kind of integration with existing or new built access control uh, systems and we are proud as iris id certified distributor to give you of course full sales and full uh, technical support so you are kindly welcome also to our booth number 87 and 3 p.m we have presentation of our products in james bond james bond hall so welcome to the world of biometrics. Thank you, Mr. Mandel. Yes. Thank you, Goles.